Hello my beautiful friends and happy Valentine's Day. I finally opened my Minions Valentine's Day blind bags. I got two of them and I was very lucky to have gotten both of the little figures that you were able to collect in this Valentine's Day series. I just want to say that I love the packaging, how this Minion is full of kisses. So cute. And here are the figures all put together. They are from Mega Bloks, I believe. So here we have Kevin who's holding up a sign that says I'm with Stupid, but they crossed off the S and the T and put a C under it to say I'm with Cupid. So he's not a very big fan of Valentine's Day. <laughs> and here we have Bob. I think that's Bob. And he's dressed as Cupid, of course. Look at him with his Cupid wings and his bow and arrow. He's just super cute. And I just thought these figures were really adorable and worth showing to you guys. Especially since we're um, in the Valentine's Day season. So they're definitely cute. They were very difficult to put together. Especially their little shoes. But look at how worth it they were to finally uh, finish and put together. They're so cute. So anyways, I hope you guys think they're cute too. And I hope you guys are having an awesome Valentine's Day. Love you guys. Hello my beautiful friends, it's Eddie here and I hope that you guys had a beautiful Valentine's Day. Um, I was very lucky enough to have seen, to have seen my best friend uh, for Valentine's Day week. She was in town uh, earlier this week and she lives a few hours away now that she's in school. But anyways, I also got to hang out with my family and my sisters and we had dinner on Valentine's night. So it was pretty fun. I hope that you all uh, got to spend time with your loved ones. Anyways guys, today I am so happy and I can't stop smiling because I got a, a card in the mail, a Valentine's Day card from one of my amazing friends here on YouTube and um, her channel name is Life with Crystal. Hi Crystal, I hope you're watching this. Life with Crystal is one of my favorite channels here on YouTube. I've been a fan of hers for years and you know to even call her a friend now is honestly a blessing. I would have never thought that she'd want to be my friend. <laughs> I check YouTube every day to see if Crystal uploaded a video because I just love her videos and look this card is coming all the way from Canada. That is so cool and uh, please check her out although I'm sure most of you know her by now. And she sent me a Valentine's Valentine's Day card that's from Strawberry Shortcake and I, I love getting cards you guys or little letters anything like that I just think it's so like I don't know I feel like it's coming from the heart and I just love cards and it says to Eddie you're awesome hope you get well soon thank you Crystal I'm doing much better and it says from Crystal and the babies of course she makes reborn videos please check her out I love hearing about her day she just has such a rela relaxing voice so I love you, Crystal. And here's the card. It says, I'm very glad we're friends. Look at that. And it's Strawberry Shortcake and her kitty. And they're holding a strawberry balloon. I just love this so much. And it made me smile. And it totally made my day. Thank you so much, Crystal, for taking the time to send me this all the way from Canada. You're amazing. Please check her out, you guys. I just wanted to share that with you guys because I love getting cards and letters. I just, I think that they're so meaningful. So thank you guys so much for watching. I always feel like I have to dress up when I'm gonna make like a little video but I'm always like no I'm just gonna talk to my friends because I feel like you guys are my friends and I can just be in my lazy clothes with you like all the time you're awesome <laughs> hey guys so I'm gonna give you guys an update on my face um basically I don't know how well you can tell through the camera but I feel like I'm almost fully recovered and before I you know go into detail about um the recovery I just want to thank you guys for everything because Honestly, you guys gave me so much support on my Bell's Palsy video, and um, I couldn't have done this without you, so thank you so much. Um, so we're almost in week number four that I was diagnosed with Bell's Palsy. Um, if you don't know what I'm talking about, I'll have a link in the description so you can um, see what was wrong with my face. Um, but anyways, for those of you that do know and you're keeping, um, you know, with these updates, keeping up with these updates, um, I'm here to give you an update. Um, as you can see... My smile is almost fully there. It's not there 100%, but it's almost there. Back to its normal. Um, the side of my face that was paralyzed, which is this side, um, I'm starting to be able to move my eyebrows now. Obviously, this one still moves more than this one. Sorry about my under eyes. <laughs> but, um, hello, text message. But um, I'm starting to be able to move it now. And I can squint this side of my face now. And um, that's good. I'm, I have my movements back. So I'm almost fully recovered. My ear no longer, you know, is sensitive. And my eye doesn't cry anymore. It still doesn't fully close. But um, guys, I'm almost recovered. And I just want to say thank you so much for sticking with me. If for some reason I were to stay like this, because I know that some people do um, stay with certain, like, imperfections after they have Bell's Palsy. 
honestly, to me, it's just a face. <laughs> like this, like there's more important things to worry about, you know, besides how my smile is gonna stay or how how much my eyebrow is gonna raise or not raise up at all. But anyways, I just wanna thank you guys. Um, thank you for um, keeping up with these updates. I love you guys and I'll see you guys very soon. Bye. Guys, I want you to check these out. These are called submarinos and they're basically the Mexican version of Twinkies. But instead of having the white stuffing in the middle, it's actually strawberry. They're really yummy. But Twinkies are still better. So I cut the little bread in half so you guys can see the strawberry filling. It is so good. But like I said, uh, Twinkies are still tastier. Thank you guys for watching. Hello, my beautiful friends. Just wanted to quickly show you my new brat stall that was purchased last night. So I ended up choosing this brat stall right here, which is the 2016 Bratz Remix Yasmin. Look at the cute little artwork. Check out her awesome shoes. And here she is. She's so stinking cute. But I'm having such a dilemma here because um, I don't know if I want to take her out of the box or not. Like this always happens to me, especially with my brat stalls. Like, I, I can't ever decide if I want to take them out of the box or not. I think for now I'm just going to keep her in there. But she's just so cute. And she comes with like these headphones and they have like butterfly things on the top she comes with a little phone and a hairbrush and i really like her little booties or shoes they're super cute i don't know i can't ever decide if i want to open them or not but when i have whenever i go through this i just keep them in the box because i feel like if i do unbox them i'll regret it and obviously once they're out of the box there's not much that i can do i really want that sasha oh my goodness thank you guys for watching